Hey, what's up, guys? What's up? What's up? Got a special, special hot toy today, as you guys can see. The Predator Warrior. And he is hot. Super, super hot. I am amazed. Totally amazed. I mean, I know I probably say it a lot in my reviews, but, you know, the guys at Hot Toys, you know, give them a special shout out. Thank you very much. Because this guy is like unbelievably, insanely, madly, like, detailed, just to the fullest, like, I have not one complaint I can say about this guy, like, as you guys can see, the level of detail is amazing, I said that probably like 20 times, because you gotta see it for your own eyes, guys, um, with that being said, you know, let me go into the box real fast. I'm sure you guys seen that already. Nice, beautiful box. Detail. Nice lip cover. Nice materially done. Nice weight to it. This is brought to you by uh, the producers at Hot Toys, Howard Chan. Thanks again, man, for all your hard work with these figures. And thank you to your crew. Um, with that all being said, guys... I mean, let's just look. Look at this guy. <sighs> let's just look. Let me take a breath. All right. This figure right here, it's like from the bottom one to the top. You can see the diorama. It's like amazingly done. Looks like straight rocks. You know, that's done well. Done very well by Hot Toys again. Um, the feet sculpt with this guy is amazing. I mean, the, the paint application, the claws, the tusks coming out the side of the feet. It's beautifully done. Especially with, like, the different shading effects going on with the, the, the feet are just outstanding, guys. The leg gauntlets, the shin gauntlets. Nice weathered effect. Nice rusted type of weathered, like, a metal. Just is done banging and as you can see Hot Toys use the new body for this guy um, the new body that they use is a little shorter than the old Predators so I'm going to definitely uh, do a quick size comparison with the other Predators and uh, some other Hot Toys let you guys see the height but um, so I'm going to keep it short but uh, as you can see the body is nicely done this time around everything joints all the joints are working perfectly tight um, Another thing I like about this figure, I forgot to mention with the uh, delay gauntlets this time around, they're not made on to the figure like how, uh, you know, the Wolf Predator. I didn't like that too much, but this guy, he can take everything off if you need it to be. If you want to customize him, hook him up however you want, he's good to go for that. Uh, with that being said, back with the, the, uh, the leg armor on the top, that's nicely done, nice and snug, fits to the leg pretty well same type of paint, paint application used for the, uh, the, you know, all of the armor basically is same color paint or whatever with the nice weathered effect, which is just outstanding. So with that being said, let me get a little more closer view on this guy. Yeah, the movie just went off too. I'm about to actually check it out, but that was the music to the movie. I'm about to check that John out because, uh, this guy make you want to check the movie out. Right around the uh, waist area, as you can see. Nice armor, same type of paint. Nice detail. Uh, sorry, D design going on in there. The uh, the cloth, the real cloth in there. Uh, that belt looks like it's real leather, but it's like a plastic material, which looks real good. The scope. The trophies, you guys can see that. That's just all amazing. Right here with the gauntlet, still got the exploding detonator device. Then just like the alien, I uh, can't get the word out, sorry, alien technology like design that's all in there. Just the, the sculpting and everything, that's just amazing. You can see, see that Hot Toys captured all of that. And even down with the hands, the fist. <clears throat> Excuse me. 
you see the little freckles and the paint design and the skin texture going on in there that's just awesome look at that it's awesome guys joints everything worked perfectly love the fact that all this can move now there's the detonator right there just awesome arm armor banging chest armor Everything is amazing with this figure, guys. Nicely detailed. Get a little close up in on there. I thought the, uh, since we're at the head area, I thought the mask was too big, but you know what? Now that I got him in my hands, I see the mask is perfect. I wouldn't change a thing with this guy. Bloody skull. Looks very gory and detailed, as you can see. The blades this time around are more extendable. And I gotta mention this, you know, this again, I just love the fact that you can turn it around. So different positions, because like I said earlier, the wolf predator, you couldn't do that with him. So you guys can see them trophies are more detailed this time around. Look at that, that's amazing. That strap right there is really adjustable that is real leather so that's amazing trophy around the neck are most definitely detailed this time around I love the dreads at first I thought they were kind of short but nah I keep them like they are love how they got the short little tiny ones in the top area that's pretty cool little small shoulder armor over there turn them around real quick so you guys can see other views Turn them to this side right here. And there you have it, guys. And now I'm going to show you guys with some different uh, figures and the height, different heights that uh, you can get going on with this guy. All right, guys, here we have it. The different comparisons to the other hot toys that's out there. As you can see, the wolf is the tallest. And then the Predator 1 is taller than our true type figures. Um, you know, a lot of people said they didn't look really like the height. They think he should be taller. Nah, I think he's perfect the way he is because, you know, you want that uh, different different height comparison and everything. So your figures, are, you know, have their own characters and everything. As far as I don't even like with the hair, you know, you got that more wilder look that goes with, you know, the whole character and everything. So, um yeah, with all that being said, you know, pick these guys up if you can. You know what I mean? Represent the hot toys. Um, definitely going to have some more Predator figures and other hot toy guys to come. Alrighty. Peace, guys.